Hello, my name is James Robinson and I want to tell you about uh, a brand new book that has just been published uh, right now. The Ichiku book of Hans Christian Andersen's Fairy Tales in Scots. And this is a beautiful hardback full of amazing illustrations. Um, let me see if I can just show you some of those just now. Um, just look at this book, it's just beautiful. And uh, there are nine of Hans Christian Andersen's fairy tales dealt in Scots by different writers. Uh, we've got Elaine C. Smith in here, we've got Shane Strachan, we've got Tam Clark, we've got Val McDermott, we've got Matthew Fitt, who is uh, one of the editors along with myself. We've got Susie Briggs and Ashley Douglas and Sheena Blackhall, and they tell these tales in their own dialects and versions of Scots, um, but they're really easy, easily accessible to everybody, uh, no matter what part of the country you come from. Uh, and some of the stories are funny, and some of them are exciting, and some of them uh, are, uh, are full of witches and uh, goblins and all kinds of things. And some of them, like the one I'm going to read to you just now, are quite sad. This one's called The Lassie in the Snow, about a wee lassie that sells matches out in the street uh, every day. And um, I'll just read the first two or three paragraphs of this, just to give you a taste of it. Oh, the nicht was that bitter cold. You wouldn't want to be any place but him. But the wee lassie that had been selling matches all day was out there still. And she was freezing. It was Hogmanay, and licht scaled through the windows of the rich houses all about her. The street was foo, or the smell of good scran, but she'd no had a bite to eat the hail day, no one wee peck. Even still she was feared to gang him. She'd sell hardly any matches, and she kent her feather would scalp her for that. See, she stayed out in the snow. She was that cold she couldn't even greet. The flocks of snow skinkled on her hair as bricht as bonny jewels, but jewels didn't mean a thing to her. She curried into herself by the wall of a hoose, tucking her feet up to try and give them a heat, but her body had nae heat to gie. Her bare naked feet were as cold as the snow. So things are no looking that great for the wee match lassie, but something magical happens just after that. But you'll need to read the book, read the story, to find out what happens. So there you are. The Ichiku book, Hans Christian Andersen's Fairy Tales in Scots, and it's available right now. I hope you enjoy it.